Hey guys, you did it. You made it to week seven. We are officially halfway done with this challenge and I'm so, so proud of you. I know there have been a lot of obstacles. There's been a lot of struggles. A lot of you have been getting sick. It's that time of year. And unfortunately, things are going around, but you're adjusting. This is lifestyle. This is something that we, we are continuing on past this 12-week challenge, but we're officially halfway through. So I need you to do a lot of self-evaluation this week, a lot. Like I really need you to dig deep, see are you close to hitting those goals? What were the goals that you set in the very beginning, that big ultimate goal? Make sure that we've got mini goals set up each week. Make sure that you're filling out that weekly game plan with what your meals are and what your measurements are and where you wanna go and what you wanna do for the week so that you can you know, continually push forward. This actually right now is the end of my first 12 weeks of I did a little 12 week year for myself and my life and my business and so I know what it's like when you're right in the middle of it and you're like, oh, like, I think I'm doing well with this. I don't know if I'm doing so well with this, so I need to adjust. And doing that weekly game plan every single week, I know it can be hard to do. I know it can. But every single week, just committing to doing that weekly game plan so that you have an idea of when you're doing your meal planning, when you're doing your grocery shopping, when you're doing your meal prepping, which meals you're going to have each week. Um, it really helps. It helps me personally. And so I hope that it helps you too, because that's why I created it. So I really want you to do a ton of self-evaluation. I want you to sit down and make sure, um, and I'm sorry, this is so late. I literally just got home from work, but I want you to sit down and I want you to see what are my measurement differences in six weeks? What are my eating habit differences in six weeks? What has gotten really great in the last six weeks? What did I wish would get better? this past six weeks that I can work on for the next six weeks because we still have six weeks left of this challenge. And so I want you to make sure that you're pushing forward and that we're progressing and moving in the direction that you want to be in. So tons of self-evaluation this week. I really want you to dig deep, figure out, you know, what was that initial goal that you set and how close are you to getting it? And what adjustments do we need to make so that you can reach your goal? And if maybe that goal is not going to happen this 12 weeks, but what do we want to progress towards over the next six weeks. Does that make sense? I hope it does. So that's what I really want you to do today and tomorrow. I want you to really self-evaluate. We've got six solid weeks left. We are into week seven, into the end of this challenge. And I really want you to, you know, think about the things that are going well, the things that aren't going well. Are you okay with the things that aren't going well? Um, are you still progressing towards your goals? And, you know, this is totally individualized to you. So I really want you to be real with me in your email, and I'm sorry that I'm late on getting back to them. It's been crazy these last few days. I've literally been home for like an hour. So bear with me. I will get back on track and making sure that I can support you in every single way that you need, and I hope that this helps, and I hope that you guys continue to move forward this week and have an awesome week. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.